A major milestone in the St. Louis County Council this week to get rid of a huge North County eyesore. They approved $6 million to demolish the failed Jamestown Mall in North County tonight. I talked to the councilwoman behind the demolition money. She's hoping for rebirth. That is the nice you paid for it. The St. Louis County Council approved $6 million to demolish Jamestown Mall in North County. That's 1,250,000 square feet. It's been abandoned 11 years. Various county executives have promised action only to fall short for one reason or another. Councilwoman Shalanda Webb, who represents the area of the mall, pushed through the legislation to use $6 million to demolish it. The county will take $6 million in pandemic funds to free up $6 million in the county budget to pay for the demolition of Jamestown. How do you feel getting to- I'm elated, elated. Last night, uh, the district assistant was teasing me and she kept saying, you're gonna cry, you're gonna cry. And I was like, I'm not gonna cry. And immediately when I started talking, I can feel myself, my, 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 my emotions starting to rise. And even I was getting excited, excited and giddy. Why? Because we have waited so long. We have been, patient, graceful, working within the, the rules, and still we get promises and promises not kept. All I wanted to do is to make sure that my community was heard. The mall that was once the center of activity in this area shut down around 11 years ago. This legislation was important because it is one of the biggest concerns of the people that I serve. Nowhere, it doesn't matter where you go, Mr. Davis, Jamestown Mall is brought up whether it's a town, meet, town hall meeting for uh, public safety, if it's a town hall meeting about ARPA, wherever you go, James Town Mall is at the forefront of everyone's mind who lives in North County. She hopes the county will look for a developer while the demolition is in progress. Last time out, the county only got one proposal from one developer, Councilwoman Webb, hoping for better results this time. What kind of development would you like to see? a multi-purpose use. I mean, there's so many needs in this community and a, a facility that will, a multiple facilities that will address the community needs for students, address, uh, like we said before, uh, some housing needs, also address entertainment, eateries, and some shopping. We know it'll never be a mall again. We are not delusional. Jamestown Mall has been a problem in our community for 11 years. And this went from an eyesore to a health hazard to a public safety hazard. What more has to happen there for people to realize that this does not belong in a bedroom community? Now, Councilwoman Webb, not saying how long it's going to take to get something built on a property once it's demolished, but she says she is committed to moving as quickly as possible. Of course, you know. I'll keep track on this deal after all. You paid for it.